Thanks for joining us on the John Mandola Show. We are driven by McCarthy Tire and Automotive Centers. Let's talk North Pocono football. Ben Dial joining us right now. Ben, I'm sure you're geared up, ready to go. Uh, got guys like Tyler Musgrave uh, are ready to play for you. And uh, the Slagus guy up front. Uh, there's some players there. You happen to be uh, one of those guys in that mix that's going to be a leader for this team. Uh, let's talk about how your summer's going. I know. We're coming on every day, putting in work. We uh, finally have a lot of depth for once, so we're ready for the season. We're hungry. How about for you, uh, let's talk about the positions you're going to play this year, both uh, offensively and defensively. Uh, yeah, I'm going to be the outside linebacker just like years before, and then I have to uh, step up and step in a wide receiver, which will be new, but I'm ready for it. Ben, uh, what's the part of the game you like most about football? Uh, is the physical side of it? I, I know your your brother, uh, he was a, an edgy player, and uh, how about for you, uh, same? Yeah, I'm a real fan of the uh, physicality of it, I like toughness. How about Coach Dolan and the mindset that he has? Let's talk a little bit about what it's like for uh, him and the coaching staff and, and, and that experience that you've had with them. Coach Dolan, he just tells us, you know, we got to be good people first. We got to um, work well. We got to be good students first. And then on the field, you know, just get it done, feed every day. How about that weight room for you? Uh, something that uh, you, you kind of like. Uh, Coach mentioned that uh, that's one of the things that uh, you like to do. Tell us a little bit about how you hit that weight room and and some of your favorite lifts? Oh, yeah, every day, you know, I just go in there, try to get better. It's one of my favorite parts. I'm a big fan of the uh, squat and deadlift. I think it's a real test of the true strength. Well, those are some of the hardest lifts and some that you kind of shy away from maybe as you get older, but uh, right now you're embracing those. Uh, ben, is uh, football something that you're thinking about at the next level? Yeah, I would love to uh, be able to play in the college. And as far as an area of study, have you thought about uh, – you know, something that you're looking at as far as that goes? Um, I'm thinking like sports management or teaching, something along those lines. Ben, uh, let's talk about the, some of the teams on your schedule this year. I don't know how much time you put into looking at it, but uh, there's going to be some good competition and, uh, of course, the change in format from now 6 Division, 6A, 5A, 4A, 3A, all the way down to, to single A. Uh, talk about uh, what you're looking forward to with some of those games. I'm looking forward to the uh, first game of the year against Riverside. I think they're going to be a real good challenge for us. I think they'll really test, test how we're doing this year. How about offensively? Uh, who do you think uh, you guys are, are going to be leaning on? Let's talk about some of those guys first on that offensive line. Uh, I know uh, guys like Slagus, uh, they're one of them. We also have some uh, some good-sized tackles, too. Yeah, we do. Jason Metzger, he's going to be a real good kid, be a leader. Our center, Matt Caputo, he'll be able to lead everyone here. He'll step up whenever we need him. And Slagus, like you said, he just, he'll step up. Help kids whenever he can. That backfield of yours, Tyler Musgrave, should be a guy who's going to get some carries. But uh, you got a young quarterback that Coach is excited about that got some experience last year as well. Talk about some of those skill guys in that backfield. All right, we have real depth at running back. Uh, we got Matt Craig, who's a real speedster. We got J.C. Gunn. He'll come out there and hit you every play. How about over on the defensive side? Uh, let's talk about the, the linebackers in, in particular. We actually have all four of our uh, starting linebackers from last year, J.C., Brett, Tyler, and myself, so we're ready for that. Then how about in the secondary? Uh, we got Mike Qualsey coming back from last year. Uh, we have Larry Napolitano. He's playing free safety right now. And then Matt Craig will be the other corner as of now. We're talking with Ben Dial from North Pocono here on the John Mandola Show. Uh, ben, let's talk about your family and, uh, you know, hanging out with your brothers, doing some stuff, and, uh, and then, you know, just – the overall part of, I'm sure, uh, mom and dad have a role, whether it's pushing you in the classroom or, or pushing you in the sports end. Uh, talk a little bit about the Dial family. Yeah, my uh, dad, he played football when he was younger, too, so he just wants me to go out there every time, you know, do my best. My mom, uh, she, she used to be a teacher, so she's all focused on the grades. She wants me to do my best in there. And then uh, when I was a sophomore, actually, I played with my brother, who was a senior, which is real awesome. And then this year... Uh, my little brother, he'll be a sophomore, so I'll get to teach him, just like my little brother did. A good family tradition. I'm sure uh, when you guys aren't playing, uh, you know, football on a team, there's probably some sports going on at home and, and uh, probably breaking a couple tables every so often, huh? Yeah, we're always being a little edgy around here. Uh, it's always a little bit of fun, that brotherly love that you have and that competitiveness you have as well. Well, Ben, we wish you the very best uh, this season there for North Pocono. Of course, the best in your future endeavors with hopefully a football career, maybe something in sports man management or education, okay? Thank you. Thanks for having me on there.
Ben Dial from the North Pocono Trojans, ready to hit the field here on the John Mandola Show. We are driven by McCarthy Tire and Automotive Centers.